I actually need to record, first of all. Big mistake on my part. I actually need to record, but it appears that the uh, game's uh, working for them. So, Vert was having some uh, issues in game, but it looks like they have it all uh, figured out now. So, bringing it to a uh, rooftop here, let's see how well these two awesome fighters can do. Of course, Tigre, incredibly fast, very bu good buttons character. And then we have Hockey, very good air game with the Aang. Definitely has... <laughs> Virtue's gonna kind of fall there. Sometimes you just gotta... <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta, you know... It's been a very common occurrence on this stream where people just magically die. You know, sometimes it just happens. I don't know what Vert was even doing there, but it looked cool. <laughs> sometimes you just gotta do the recovery on the game and get on the ground and just dash off. But it's been a very, very common occurrence that people just magically die, you know, of their fault or not, you know, off stage sometimes. <laughs> Ooh, do we see the spike? Just barely missed it. Unfortunate for Vert. Definitely would have been a good early kill for him. Needed that momentum there. But yeah, Aang with the up tilts, the forward tilts, is definitely going to be able to cover Aang's approach, uh, El Tigre's approaches, but it's how well Hockey can call them out. I think we're going to see Hockey overall on the defense, or, you know, the bait and punish side of this game, but we'll have to see as time goes on right now. Just kind of getting a little destroyed and a little carried off stage. Just going to carry him to the ledge for him. A double. <laughs> but just barely not going to kill. That slime cancel coming on in and hurting Vert there. And up here. Just barely not going to kill. Burst is on hockey's side if needed. Stalling once with the down air. Trying to carefully make it back to ledge. But wastes the needles. Unfortunate. The backer gonna take the stock though. But not gonna get to kill with the aerial forge strong. Unfortunately for hockey here, it's not looking too good for them. But gonna be finding that up strong though. Trying to find something here. Not going to get a random recovery hit there. Try to get a stray hit, get Lou, whatever in. Burst is still on Hockey's side, but has to play. I think we're really seeing Hockey play that defensive game, like I said earlier. Just going straight for the spike. <laughs> Goes for the aerial down strong. I, I appreciate the disrespect from Vert's side, but killed him in the process for it. <laughs> we'll find it again, though. Really wanted to end the game with the aerial down strong, so... Man's got my respect. Really wanted to end it with the down strong. <laughs> hey, sometimes you choose how you want the game to end. Sometimes you just do. Let's bring it to game two here. Let's see what these awesome fighters can do. Gonna be bringing it to Pariah still, so bigger stage. Let's see how well Hockey can use this to their advantage. I think, once again, Hockey, once again, my opinion, is gonna be going for those defensive plays, seeing them running away, trying to get the needle started, trying to trying to find something here. <laughs> Restart, I died off stage. <laughs> We let sound alerts during stream for some reason. <laughs> but very getting loot too crazy with the aerial forward strong there. <laughs> Would you like to restart? <laughs> Would you? We're gonna be fine that throw there, going deep with the up strong. Get some with the recovery. I thought we were gonna see Vert go for the you know the signature forward strong, but no. I like how he used that up strong, getting that recovery. You have to fear for your life because if you think you're safe off stage, that is exactly where Tigre wants you. He can go just as deep as you are off stage. You were never safe up against this little tiger man. <laughs> 
but bursts to escape. But didn't you not wanting some early percent damage from Vert there? Can the hockey get good advantage of it? Finds the forward strong, gets the burst out of Vert. Yeah. Goes for recovery, getting that extra damage, getting that little a bit of little bit of extra attack on. Finds a Nerdo. And the upstrong is going to claim Hockey's life there. But, you know, this is going to do the Vert thing and, you know, fall off stage once again. That's two games in a row where Vert has fallen off. <laughs> Vert's too good to fall off, but, you know, he's fallen off. <laughs> Sometimes you just got to assert dominance by just saying, I don't need to stock. Sometimes you just got to do it. Starting with the dash attack there. Get these sword strongs. Do we see a spike? No, missed it. Remember, you can DI Aang's up throw. Finally, now. <laughs> well, no burst on the hockey side now. Let's see how well we can get something out of that burst. Find a good back here. Trying to go deep with deep, forward strong. You love to see it, but Vert might be too deep. No, the slime pops him up just in just enough. But it doesn't matter when a good flaming kick knocks him out. Good forward strong from hockey. But trying to get these needle combos going. We'll drop it though. But a good ledge hog from hockey will end that game. A fantastic ledge hog. Let's go. Let's go. That was one of the best ledge hogs I've freaking seen. <laughs> All right, gonna be going to game three here after a little moment. Let's get in action. They're bringing it back to Pariah's Keep once again. Let's see how well this works in Vert's favor this time. I don't think uh, Pariah's is a bad stage for uh, Tigre, cause he, <laughs> you know. When Vert falls off stage one more time, <laughs> you know, he did the Vert thing. <laughs> you know, Bread was talking about what's the Vert thing. I think we figured out what's the Vert thing. Him just dying. <laughs> but. <laughs> Once again, I don't think this is really bad Tigrid Sage, you know, of course, the Blast Zone's on the side being a little bit smaller, potentially, so that's really going to help him when it comes to these four strongs. But once again, the neutral, and the Sage Adventures that Hockey can potentially get is just as strong as well. Catching that roll with a four strong, we'll take the stock, though. But finding some needles, not able to get an extension out of it, but Hockey doesn't need to. He has the lead, playing patiently, letting Vert make all the mistakes for him. But yeah, no, sometimes if you hold shield when the game starts, you just spawn in holding the shield viper, uh, hyper. I've done it as Zim. <laughs> just as what it is. If you get a little too trigger happy before the game starts, you spawn in with your shield already half gone. <laughs> and as we is a perfectly functional game. <laughs> Getting with the down air or the air ball, once again, incredibly long active hitbox, you know, just gonna stop Red from recovering there. Of course, to play the rest of the tourney on Nasby 1. You know what? Maybe. I might reinstall just if chat, I might reinstall just in case chat wants it, but then there's no OT gray. <laughs> but I am curious, hi, at first, since you're up on in here, you know, uh, do you play Garfield at all this game, or, you know, you don't like what they did to uh, Garfield in this game? Because I'm curious. For some of those who don't know, Hypercrasher was, um, 
Probably the best Garfield in NASV1, but you know, we've seen him on the up tilt in Donatello now. <laughs> But, that's understandable. But still, <laughs> we joke about the up tilts here, Hyper Crasher, but your Donatello pops off, man. I'll joke about the up tilts all day, but your, your, your Donatello pops off, man, my, my, for real. Plus all the things I like about an SV1 Garf who got changed or nerfed in 2, I feel that I feel that. But, <laughs> that, <laughs> the glider is going to take out T Gray off stage, you know, a little, a little something funny happens. <laughs> But here we are, going into game four here. We have uh, Food Dreams. Uh, give me one second, checking some stuff real quick, everybody. So enjoy some good old Food Dreams music. <laughs> Sorry about that, everybody was uh, checking out some stuff. Anyways, let's bring it back in action. Vert starting strong this match. Already taking the first stock here. Going deep. Finds the spike. No. Just barely not able to find a good DI on hockey's side. But once again, Electric, don't worry about how well you do in early tournaments. Just get used to the game. And hey, just thank you for playing Nasby too, honestly. Just thank you. Like I said, I just hope I can give a, you know, a cool tournament and a cool place for everybody. Just, you know, be able to hang out and meet cool people. Because that's my goal with this game. Just That's really my goal with the tournament as a whole. Just, just be able to make a community of just, you know, awesome people being able to play. So that's what I'm all about here. Of course, I hate anybody who's better at the game than me, but <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Bring it here. Trying to find a back air. Trying to get something good here. Once again, the forward air gonna send upwards, so gotta go for the back air. But we see Vert just getting a little predictable, having his one good killing aerial. <laughs> so Hockey just spacing himself around it. He's in Hockey played a patience game before. We know he's not gonna let Vert be able to get in on him just as just easily now. Forward strong will take him out though. But once again, down the entire stock though. Toad, Hyper is gonna have to do some good work here. Not Hyper, because we're talking about Hyper Crash here. <laughs> we're here gonna have to put in some work though. <laughs> yeah, we've been up to this for three and a half hours now, so I'm feeling a little out of it now. So the commentary, while never good, it's definitely not gonna be the best now. <laughs> Find a good aerial up strong. How can you gonna be able to close it out? Let's go. Start to throw. Let's keep it going. Get the re-grabs in here. But of course that frame three shine. Have to be ready for it. I'm not gonna quite <laughs> can't get anything on the T grade, because you know what? You get immediately mashed out on. <laughs>
find the second area of Sean once again, getting these glider kills, getting everything. This is what Aang needs. He gets those deep offstage kills and in the air. And if Hockey can potentially find his way around this, we can see him close this game out right now with another aerial up strong. It's not looking too good revert here. The forward strong actually just gonna do it. I didn't think it would do it, but wow, it's actually just strong enough to. Hockey gonna take the set with a clean 3-1. Let's freaking go. Some nice air bending. <laughs> 